In this video, I will explain what procrastination is, why it occurs, and what you can do about it. Please join me. I'm Dr. Michael Patterson, clinical psychologist. For years, I've been working with people to help them achieve their maximum potential. I've been posed with a particular scenario. Here it is. I hope you he can help me understand something that I've been doing for as long as I can remember. When faced with assignments, or really any task I need to do, I keep putting it off. When it gets to the time that the work has to be completed, I end up rushing. The worst thing is, I'm wound up and the job isn't done as well as it should be. So what we're talking about here is procrastination. Why does it occur? Well, it is usually due to fear. Fear of success or fear of failure. This means that it is due to experiences that we have had during our lives. We learn that certain situations are threatening to us. For example, succeeding, it's a potential threat to us. We're afraid to succeed. Or we've learned that failing is not an option based on earlier life experiences. So we become afraid of that particular situation too. Whenever we feel that fear, then we have an increase in our arousal. We then go into survival response. We rush things. We can't think clearly. I have produced another video in this series, which is about what holds people back from achieving their potential. You may wish to have a look at that too. When we procrastinate, the pain of doing something is greater than the pain of not doing it. But as the deadline approaches, things flip. The pain of not doing it becomes greater than the pain of doing it, and then we rush it. When that occurs, we go into a state of stress. Our stress hormones are released. Our rational thinking goes out the window, and we're rushing things. We're not doing our best job. There is a solution, of course. For example, if you have an appointment at, let's say, 10 a.m., instead of leaving it to the last moment to get there, leave in plenty of time. Arrive at 9.55 a.m. That way, you're calm, you're relaxed. It makes intuitive sense. The same principle applies when we are faced with a particular task. We set goals. Know when it is that we have to have the project completed by. And then we do the three P's. We plan, we prepare, and we proceed. Planning. Work out what you need to do, when you need to do it by. Prepare. What do you need in place to make things happen? Once the plan is in place and you have prepared, proceed. Get the job done. Aim to get it done well in advance of the deadline. That means that you remain calm. You think clearly. You think rationally. The job gets done. And it gets done well. I hope this video has been helpful. Please do subscribe free at the link down below. I want to help you become the best that you can possibly be. I'm Dr. Michael Patterson. I'll see you up there.